one of my favorite parts on uh, Pulp Fiction. You know what I mean? It's when they were sitting there having that um, that five dollar shake. You know what I'm saying? And they got up and start cutting up the rug with that Chuck Berry tune. If you don't know what I'm talking about, here we go. I was a teenage wedding and the old folks wished them well. You could see that Pierre did truly love La Mademoiselle. Now that the young monsieur and madame had rung the chapel bell. C'est la vie, c'est the old folks, it goes to show you never can tell. They furnished off an apartment with a Sears and Roebuck sale. The coolerator was crammed with TV dinners and ginger ale. She couldn't cook. When Pierre found work, the little money came in, worked out well. Say la vie, say the old folks, it goes to show you never can tell. Tempo of the music sort of fell for various reasons. Say the beast, say the opals, it goes to show you never can tell. Mercedes was a cherry red 53 Drove it down to New Orleans To celebrate their anniversary It was there where Pierre Was wedded to the lovely mademoiselle Say la vie, say the old folks It goes to show you never can tell
was good right there. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that. I was thinking about a bunch of different things like the movie that I was just talking about prior to, Pulp Fiction. And then, it, you know, it just got me thinking about who are my favorite actors. Do I even have a top five? You know what I'm saying? But John Travolta is definitely in there. Denzel Washington is definitely in there. Samuel Jackson is definitely in there. Bruce Willis, definitely. And if I had to have one more, I like I like Nicolas Cage, you know. Um, uh, I, I wouldn't know. But, yeah, if you ain't seen Pulp Fiction, go check it out. And Chuck Berry's fucking icon, like. Every time I see Chuck Berry, I'm interested, I'm I'm tuned in, I'm ready to see what he got in the store for me. It's always something good. But I hope you enjoy this. Drop me a comment and let me know what you think.